Okay, Agent. As soon as you lock the situation down, I've got a joint Sarah JTF strike force ready to move in. They'll take samples from the refugees that they can find. Medical personnel? A couple of EMTs in the mix, Doctor. Yes. A couple? As in only two? The rest are first aid certified. They know how to tap a vein. Get going, Agent. Without contaminating the samples, I assume. Or infecting themselves. Yes. Take your word for it. Thank you, Doctor. Get moving, Agent. Then label and group the samples according to... Excuse me, doctor. But maybe this could wait until we get confirmation the op is actually complete. You saying you don't have faith in your agent? Just focusing on the task at hand. Lieutenant, you'll radio the doctor as soon as the area is secured. Yes, ma'am. Don't worry, doctor. We'll get it all worked out. I hope so. It's only the survival of the human species we're talking about. Copy that, Doc. Patel, out. Go to work. 
Get in there. Finish the job. Agent, if you can find the crane controls, drop that tank someplace safe. Good work. Now, sample team, listen up. Like I was saying, I'm gonna need those blood samples labeled and organized so we can track corroborating factors. Let's move this discussion to a different channel so we don't bore the agent. Jesus, what are you doing? And these forced relocations, this dark zone, what is the point of that? We've already had a press conference on this. All the information is out there. Anything else is classified, and I can't comment. So you're sticking with the story that this is some kind of decontamination procedure? It's a delicate situation that we must take care of pragmatically. And we must focus on the bigger picture. I think somebody's out there. What, you mean like help? <gasps> hey, the comparative data you secured from the train yard. I mean, those refugees, of course. It gave us something to think about. There's another report in the database for you to look at.
One of the things that makes a virus lethal is adaptation. Rapid mutation makes it harder for antibodies to identify and drugs to kill. What we're seeing in the samples you pulled from the population at the train yard is the degree of genetic drift green poison is already experiencing, and it's significant, which means it'll be that much harder to find a vaccine. And these forced relocations, this dark zone, what is the point of that? We've already had a press conference on this. All the information is out there. Anything else is classified, and I can't comment. So you're sticking with the story that this is some kind of decontamination procedure? It's a delicate situation that we must take care of pragmatically. And we must focus on the bigger picture. There are millions of lives at stake here. <laughs> 